Hello, welcome to Be Nice and Collect. We are back with a scale figure review. We have here Panda, one of the likable characters in Jujutsu Kaisen. This is made by Kotobukiya. I got the regular version. I will explain later on why I skipped the exclusive one. Anyways, let's get it on. He is stored in a hard clamshell for protection. And here is our Panda. He can stand without the base which is good. He is not so big considering he looks big in the anime. Let's deep dive into its details. For his face, he looks so adorable like a panda should be. I am happy they captured the face of panda and it should be like that. For his body, the paint is okay but not great. Let's take a closer look. His claws are sharp and very well painted. While he looks fierce with his claws, his knuckles make him cute. His other fist lands to the ground like a landing pose of a superhero character. For his feet, he still have these sharp claws. And look at those paws. Even you won't see this on display, at least Kotobukiya gave some details to it. Now back to the details of the body, it is a so-so for me. It's not bad, but I am looking for something better. I'm not sure if it's the paint or the hair sculpting. I'm not sure what's the best approach in executing the paint and the sculpt. Eastream did release their own version of Panda. That one is the badass version of Panda. It will be released next year, November 2024. For his base, these are your usual Jujutsu Kaisen by Kotobukiya base, simple and not distracting at all. Here is my panda family with panda nandroid, reason why I chose the regular version since I have the baby panda from nandroid. Here is a size comparison with a pop-up parade figure, size comparison with a portrait of pirates figure, as I said earlier, he is not so big. Here is my Jujutsu Kaisen by Kotobukiya so far. They are getting better and better to look at. For my final verdict, I give this 7 out of 10. Giving this rating because of the paint. It could have been better. Don't get me wrong, I'm still happy with this purchase though. I love the pose, most especially his face. This figure was released last March 2023 at a standard retail price of 15,000 yen. It has an exclusive version where you can get the Baby Panda minifigure. It's a 1-8 scale figure that stands approximately 7.41 inches. This figure is a must-get for me because I'm collecting every Jujutsu Kaisen by Kotobukiya. They really look great together. Most especially, they are easy to display together because of their simple base and the poses are correlated. So that's it guys. If you enjoyed this video, please do consider subscribing to my channel for updates and reviews. Shout out to Toy Unboxing family, friends and viewers. See you in my next video. Keep safe everyone. Bye-bye.